Hello everybody, welcome to Sheepish Look at Ollie Ollie 2. Welcome to Hollywood. My name is Genai Kimiso Wooded Sheep, and today we're gonna take a look at a cool skateboarding game. It's a sequel to Ollie Ollie, as you might have guessed, because they're smart people. Um, except it's quite a step up uh, to the to its predecessor. So as you can see, you've got a wide variety of different chapters, and so the, the locations are more interesting than the first game for sure, which is pretty cool. I'm just gonna jump into this one here and uh, and show you what the game's like. So before you start a level, you can see there's some challenges here. I mean, you don't have to do them, which is cool. I guess you can just complete the level if you want. But if you want the extra challenge, you can try to do these. So I've only done one. You can see the middle one. Using manual landings, finish the level in one massive combo. Which feels amazing, by the way. I'm going to try to do that again. Uh, but yeah, you can. You have to get a score. Uh, 30 times 34 combo, all that stuff. And you don't have to do it. Uh, not all of them you have to complete the level. You just have to do it. And sometimes that, that counts. You have to do them in the same try, as you can see. Anyway, um, let's just start the level and see, and show you. So I'm playing with the controller, by the way, on the PC, but it does work, which is nice. Oh man, this is going to be hard to commentate, explain, and play at the same time. Um, so you can see these uh, golden... Only on this chapter it's golden, on the previous one it was blue. But uh, that's places that you can grind on. And, uh, okay, let me explain the base controls first. You, uh, I'm, I'm using a controller, so I'm just going to refer to it as the button, or button, or whatever the fuck. Uh, so you mash the button to push your board, which is A on the controller, and uh, so you build up speed. And using the left analog stick, this is best played by the way with a uh, controller for sure because of the flicking mechanism to do different certain tricks. Uh, let's just go on to the next level I guess. So if you hold down on the analog stick and then just let go of it, you'll do a normal jump, so that's an ollie. If you- oh shit, ollie ollie is dead. Oh, okay, right, I just went to the next level back. Um, so, yeah, you do that. If you hold down the, the stick and then you flick it to the right by doing a curve, then uh, you'll do a certain trick or flick it to the left or whatever. That's how you do different tricks. Um, oh, shit. Uh, so, to grind... Okay, I guess we're on this level, whatever. I've never played this level before. Oh, shit! Oh, man, that looks fucking painful. Uh, to grind, you let go of the stick and then you hold it in a direction as you're on the rail and then you'll grind and then when you let go he'll jump off and if you want to continue your combo you uh, hold left on the stick and then press A right when you land on it so basically there's loads of like a uh, it's not as complicated as I make it sound the tutorial makes it really easy to understand and it teaches you in a really nice way which is cool oh shit oh man am I gonna do this in one combo I'm not sure oh, yeah. it feels fucking cool when you chain different grinds and your entire combo is like one map in I mean throughout the entire level it's really nice oh man oh shit oh I should also point out there's a quite a bit important like timing plays quite an important role oh man did I do that in one combo nice I think I did I got an achievement for something <laughs> I'm gonna be proud of that uh, let's just see what these ones so the you can see the pink text there it's uh, I have to do certain tricks so I can press the LB button and it'll See, there's an entire list of how to do this. So you can see, you can get an idea of how like you do a trick. You flick the stick in that sense. Uh, it's very easy to do once you do it. It's not as complicated as it looks. And uh, there's grinds. You can do different grinds. Uh, you can change your stance. There's all sorts of... It's actually pretty in-depth, which is really cool. Um, it, it's really satisfying. But yeah, as I was saying, timing plays quite an issue. Uh, issue? Quite a big part uh, in the game. So before you land on the ground after you do a trick, if you you have to press the um, the the boost button, the A button, to like the button that you use to kick. See, I'm like kicking right now to get build speed. So you press it to land your your uh, trick, and the closer you are to the ground, then you'll gain a speed boost and uh, more points as well. So yeah, if you want to be risky, ah oh shit. See, like I I mistimed that completely. So I got a sloppy landing. So uh, yeah, the closer you are to the ground, you'll get a perfect landing and all that. And you also get a speed boost. And the same applies with a rail. So, ooh, see that? I got like green sparks because I perfected that landing. So yeah. But yeah, I mean, the maps are really a joy to ride through. It's, oh shit. <laughs> They're really fun. Like this one's uh, all cowboy. I prefer the second chapter actually. It was really interesting. It was like Aztec temple stuff. It was really cool with... There was all sorts of like lava stuff and traps and all that. <laughs> oh, fuck. Um, <clears throat> yeah, pretty pretty fun. And there's all sorts of cool obstacles and but yeah, again, if this looks a bit daunting to you, there's a really good training system. So what would I? Uh, I'm not really doing the challenges, am I? 
Uh, shit, I'm not gonna. Okay, I'm not gonna check now. I can't be bothered. Ooh, there's also I like I appreciate that there's a restart button. It's just I can press Y. You can see the top left corner. It's right there. You don't even need to go into the menu or anything. You just press restart if you're not happy with what you're doing. So let me see. I have to Smith grind to front big spin as part of a level long combo. Uh, I'm not feeling up for that. So yeah, the last one you can see grind all the grind markers and finish. So that's what those pink symbols are. And there's other stuff like this manual. Uh, markers. So I'm not sure if I even explained what a manual is. It's when you balance on your back wheels oh, crap, on flat surfaces. So not necessarily flat surfaces, just not a grinding surface to extend your combo. Um, it's not too hard to do, I guess. Like, but yeah, I don't know. Just the game feels awesome when you really do all sorts of moves, and like especially in one long combo, it feels really cool. Yeah, like see there, I just landed manual, so I can continue my uh, combo. I love those revolvers, they like, oh shit, oh, ouch indeed, alright let's try this level one more time, Ugh. I'm gonna try do, I think I saw in the controls like I could, no, I have no idea how to do it, there's like a way to switch your grind move, the, the way you landed and you like, Ugh. I don't know, I'll, I'll, I'll show you a tutorial actually, why not, to show you how good they are, let's see, main menu, where is it? There's a lot of stuff here. I'm going to show you actually all of them. I guess we'll just go in a row in the in order. So spots are basically you you do a you try to get as many points as you can in a certain area. So I can skip to any of these levels, which is pretty cool. The ones I've unlocked at least. So let's just do this one. Why not? So I'm going to try. It's just a small, really short map, and you just try to get as many points as you can. I'm trying to I'm trying to do that grind switch. I have no idea how to do it. Woo! Oh man! Oh shit! Oh yeah! Wasn't the best landing at the end, but uh, see, sketchy combo. But still, I did the best, and it also shows you the world's best there, so you can try to compete. It's cool. It's really good for uh, replay replay value if you want to like if you're into score attack modes and stuff. And skate park. So this is the training. Let's see. Uh, perfect grinds. So perfect grinds require the same timing as perfect landings. Whilst in the air, hold the left stick just before you go on the ledge. Perfect grinds make your board glow green and give you speed boost. So yeah, okay, this one I guess is not, but yeah, you can see, it just, it says at the top, it's like 0 out of 5, you just need to try get as many as possible, and uh, it won't let you complete the training until then, but you can obviously quit and stuff, but it, it's good, it helps you kind of master things, so that's nice. Uh, also, I need to exp say that the menus are really sleek, like, they're really, really nicely done, I don't know, just the fact that you can, you can go here, obviously, and like, move these up and down, but you can also just hold the button and do it, I don't know, it's, it's nice, it looks really cool. Uh, let's see, combo rush. Alright, this is uh, split screen mode, which is nice. I don't have anyone right now to do this with me, but you can play with a controller or a keyboard, which is cool, and you uh, compete in different sorts of tournament mode. It's cool. And there's daily grind, which is really nice, in my opinion. So you can see in the top right, I have a small timer. That's how many... I have 13 hours left to, to take part in this grind. So this is every single day they do a new challenge. So I'm just doing practice now. And so you can do the entire... Uh, track or whatever you want to call it, the stage, and practice and try perfect it as much as you can. Let's just see how well I can do on my first try. Woo! Oh man, I almost landed on some cactuses there. There you go, I, I got okay points. So I can practice as much as I want, but to actually get your score on the leaderboard, you need to click play for real. You can see in the bottom right corner, and you only get one chance at that, which is really cool. So if you fuck up, you're screwed. Go big or go home, you only get one go, so make it. So let's try to do as well as I did before, if not better. Oh man! Oh, woo. oh shit! <laughs> Let's try. Oh man! Come on, come on! I almost have one combo. Mm. Although again, one combo is not the thing that matters most. Just I also need to try vary my uh, tricks and all that. But yeah, see, I did well. At least I didn't face plant, which is cool. So there you go. I got onto the uh, leaderboard there. But you've got all of this trickish area <laughs> like that uh, profile. You can, you know. It also to stats, it's really nice, but yeah, it's really, really fun, satisfying stuff to do. I'm gonna try, like, let's just see. There's, uh, let me see how many chapters there are. There's one, two, three, four, five. Five chapters. I guess you could argue that that's not too long. What's this stuff down here, though? Oh, right, I did read. There is a hard mode, I guess, so, uh, you can... I'm not sure if it's exactly the same levels or not, but I think it might be, but you... Yeah, see, you can see rad mode there. Complete all challenges on all levels to unlock the fiendishly difficult rad mode. So you need to do all the challenges first. But yeah, it's, uh... 
it's cool. It adds a lot of replay value to try to do these challenges. It, it reminds me a lot, like, as I, I used to play Tony Hawk games all the time as a kid, and it reminds me of, like, there were things called gaps where you had to do certain things, like uh, jump from this place and do this trick after grinding on this wall. And it, it was really fun to do, and it, it was, I don't know, it was really, really satisfying when you finally managed to do it. And that's exactly what these challenges bring, and I don't know. Just all the all the colors and the score scores. Sco <laughs> I keep stuttering. All the scores appearing everywhere, it's really satisfying. Also, I'm not sure if you noticed there were like collectibles under the trains there. That was one of the challenges as well. Oh man, I'm doing really well now. Let's not fuck it up by saying that I'm doing well. Nice. Hello, cowboy man. <laughs> He's like doing a little dance for me. So cool, I did uh, two challenges. Let's do one more level. So uh, there you go, grind switch, you can see there. Grind switch three times in a level long combo. That's what I've been trying to do, but I'm not sure how to do it. So I'm going to click RB, skate park, and this training will teach me. Do a perfect grind. Oh, okay, so I need to do a perfect grind. That's what it was. Then rotate the left stick to a different location. Keep the left stick held. Then tap A button to switch to a new grind. So I need to do a perfect grind. Let's see. Bam, and then bam. There you go. See, the tutorials explain things so well. It's really cool. So now how do I... Okay, I'm going to just try jump off. Get another perfect grind. Bam. Awesome. <laughs> He's going to fall to his death there. Alright, let's just do one more level then. So I'm gonna try do that grind switch. Oh, in a level long combo? Oh man. Oh, <laughs> that's a horrible start. Let's try one more time. Whew. Don't touch the TNT, that's very, very deadly. Holy shit. Okay. Oh, that was not a perfect grind. Oh man. <laughs> it's really cool though, it, it's really fun. And again, I like that you don't have to do all the challenges in one try. Oh man, is that what a rad mode is gonna be like? Do every single challenge. I think that's impossible though, because there's some places which require you to like do a grind marker here, but go collect something else somewhere else. Oh shit, let's do a perfect grind. Come on, I want to do a grind switch. Oh man, I'm not gonna get it. I don't think I have enough time. Oh shit! There you go, I did one. Oh, there's another. Come on, give me one more rail. One more rail. Just one more, please, please, please. One more rail. Oh! Come on, yes. Yes! Oh, I think I did it. Yeah, I did it. I think. Oh man. Oh, oh, actually no, not yet. I need to do one combo. Yeah, I think I did it now. Did I? Yes, I did. Oh man, I got them all in like one try. Finish with only sick or perfect landings and manuals. Ooh, let's just try replay one more time. I'm gonna try to do that. So wait, what was it? Only. Wait, let me just, let me just uh, check that again. Finish with only sick or perfect landings and manuals. Oh shit. All right. Let's be on point with this shit. I don't think that was, I think I already fucked it up. Let's just try again. Ugh. See, this is what this game does to me, and if you're into this stuff, you will love it as well. I'm not sure if that was, nope, I fucked it up again. Yeah, I did it! Skills, you beat five challenges, have unlocked a pro level. Check it out on the level select menu. Ooh, let's try it out. Let's see what pro level is like. So it's not what rad mode is, I guess. Oh man, get a score. Okay, so wait, what was that? Quench your thirst at the great pub in the sky. What the fuck? <laughs> Is there like some? Wait, am I in the right level? I'm not even sure. Yeah, I am. So it completely changes the challenges. That's cool. Actually, it's a completely different level. Ooh! Oh man! All right, let's try restart that. Oh, <laughs> that was a fuck up. I'm really glad that it restarts instantly, which is cool. Oh shit, man! You need to time that well. All right, let's just. Oh, jump. Ooh, oh, man. Oh, there's a grind there. I thought I was going to land on some land. On some normal ground or whatever. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Mm, man. Oh, shit. You got to react fast in these fucking pro levels. Oh. <laughs> I almost shot myself with that giant revolver. Oh, shit. Come on, no. Oh, fuck. Oh, look up there. What the fuck? Is that the pub? Oh, shit. No, <laughs> so close. Ow. Oh shit. Whoa. No, <laughs> fuck. Okay, you know what? Screw it. You can buy this game and find out what's up there on your own. Alright, that's all I'm going to show you in this video, but if you like the look of what you've seen so far, then you'll definitely enjoy the game. So if that's the case, check out the link in the description to buy the game on Steam, and please like and share my video, it'll help me out if you enjoyed it. But until next time, goodbye, I love you!